all hate this. Battling traffic when you're trying to go somewhere, particularly the airport, and it's just a nightmare. You're always running for your life. It's so stressful. But there is an alternative. It costs more than a cab or car service, but it's still affordable for a lot of people, especially if you don't have any patience. Stacey Delicat introduces us to Gotham Air. Just this week, it took me one hour and $65 to get from Midtown to JFK in a taxi. So now we're going to try something that promised to take just six minutes. Let's go. And we're off. Downtown, you got 414 Delta Bureau. Next up, JFK. Here we go. Next up, there you go. All aboard Gotham Air, the latest on-demand service that promises to bring luxury chopper service to the masses. This is called the Bell 407GX. This is absolutely the latest and the greatest technology. The startup has partnered with Helicopter Flight Service to offer rides from Manhattan to local airports starting at just $99. The views beat the congested Van Wick any day. We take off at 1032. So, John, how are the conditions today? Is this the best we can hope for? Beautiful day today, yeah. We got uh, nice and sunny. It's a little bit hazy, but uh, very good conditions. When the weather is more inclement and the choppers can't fly, Gotham will shuttle you to your flight in a Tesla. But today, we were in luck. Five and a half minutes after takeoff, we'd begun our descent. It's so quick, you don't even have time to get nervous. Basically, it's taking what was once only available to celebrities and rock stars and movie stars and making it available to the rest of us. After your first flight, fares go up to about $220, but partner Emily Condon and CEO Tim Hayes think once you fly once, you'll be hooked. A taxi can be $70, a black car can be $200, but more important than that is the time. It can take, it can really take two hours to get to the airport, and with this, uh, that goes away. Your time's worth something. Time is money. Yeah, time is New York, time is money. Using the app, you can reserve a seat on an existing flight or start your own. Four passengers are needed to fly. We put a, a helicopter in everybody's hand. The app goes live next month, and the inaugural flight is on February 9th. Up above New York City, I'm Stacey Delacat, Fox 5 News. That seems pretty good to me. That's a solid business idea, I think. Yeah.